Can you see the rain dripping, everyone? Good morning. Welcome to uh, the day after the, the blizzard. Because it's over now, and it's basically time to start going and cleaning up. Now, my dad already left this morning, and he... Uh, I don't think there's actually a travel ban, but regardless, he went out. I think it's just highly recommended to stay off the roads. But, uh... So some of that down there has gotten cleared off, but uh, now it's time for me to get ready and go out and do my part and clear off my car and then start shoveling the front of the driveway because it's, I mean, you probably recall this, but there is another strip of driveway right there that has not yet been plowed, but this being nice is, or done is, is really nice and I'm glad the neighbors did that with their snowblow because I'm going to have to go out there and do that by hand, but uh, let me get ready and let's actually head out there. Well, I'm out here. It's actually not really that cold outside. I'm starting to clear off my car, obviously. But it's not really that cold outside. It's, it's at, it actually reached 32. So, it's, it is starting to warm up. This is, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna need something a little bigger. I guess that's a, that's a lot of snow. But, um, it's nice because the snow is starting to melt because of how, how warm it is outside. I'm gonna need to get a, an actual broom or brush or something to start this off. As you can see, it, it's starting to, not rain, but. Yeah, I, uh, I underestimated the amount of snow. Can you just pass me the broom? Mm -hmm. there's, there's quite a bit out there. But uh, yeah, so it's it's cleanup time, I think. Turned on my defrosters, but seeing as uh, how much snow is just sitting there, sitting on my, my windshield, that's not gonna do much. But uh, I'm gonna break up the shovel a little bit, start clearing cars off, and we'll see where we get. Well, about a half an hour later, we basically finished with the driveway. These two cars are cleared off. We're not worried about the Volvo because the battery's probably dead. And there's really no point to clearing it off because who's gonna drive it? It's a waste of energy. Um, you might notice my jacket on the stairs over there, and that's because I am just in a polo shirt because it got too hot. And I was like, yeah, no, I'm not gonna deal with that. So I didn't. And I took off my jacket. But we're, we're wrapping things up there. He just wants to clear out that ditch so that we can actually, you know, get out. But, oh man, it looks like we're almost clear with the snow. Nova, are you enjoying the snow? It's about that fun. Oh yeah, I know she does. <laughs> Look at how much is up there back at the 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 uh, the garden. And I'm not heading all the way over there to go see it, but <laughs> that's at least half the garden covered in snow. Mm -hmm. But I'm out here shooting photographs for photography and it got to a point where I literally couldn't make the camera go any faster and there's almost too much light out here. Which is not something you hear people into photography and cameras say very often. But, because uh, the snow does reflect a lot of light and it's, it's pretty, pretty glorious. Well, after two whole days working on this vlog, I am finally, finally exporting day 390, because this has taken forever to export. And there's, there's my export settings, by the way. But this has taken quite some time to work on, because if I show you guys here, I mean, that's the title, obviously, but, but this is the timeline. As you can see, my final TRT is, um, 540416. So that's 54 minutes, 4 seconds, and 16 frames. So uh, 54 minutes and 4 and a half seconds, basically. Uh, anyway, this is the timeline. Video track 1. Then here's all the audio tracks. And I had to double up some of these, these audio layers for the iPhone camera and the digital SLR. Because those were kind of quiet. And they're still kind of quiet. But, I mean, because my my main vlog camera zeroes out literally everything. I don't know if you notice right here, you have this green portion here, and that's because this is actually its own timeline. 
just filled with with uh, edited video and audio because this is the timeline that created the the nomad sync part of it so and yes it's possible to just sit there and plop a timeline into another timeline so when i got to that part i literally just worked on this timeline and ship this timeline over into here, and then just continue working all throughout here. And there are some titles hidden throughout here. Here's one, here's another one, and then here's one final one. But and that and yeah, that's how long this thing is that you can really can't even see the titles unless you zoom in a little bit. Yeah, see as you can see. It took them a little while to actually render these captions. And then this is the actual title right here, and you can't even see. There you go. You have to zoom in pretty far before you can even see the cuts that make up the title. So this is like two days worth of work here. And I've been working for pretty much four consecutive hours now on it today and like another three yesterday. So this is like a seven hour vlog. So by far, both the, I think the longest vlog and definitely the longest it's taken me to edit a vlog. This took forever. Oh man, it took forever. But hopefully it should... Uh, go decently quickly once I get past this. We've still got like uh, 23 minutes, almost 24 uh, to, to remember, remaining to render this file. So, which I mean is not bad for uh, we've been doing it for four and a half minutes now, and it's still going to take 24. I don't know why it's counting up. That's odd, but um, oh man, it's just good to have this done. <laughs> Oh, because that's been, that's been a huge weight on my shoulders in the vlog, and I guess it was good. I was actually off this weekend so I could have time to work on it, and then, you know, after this I have several other days still that are set up yet blank. So, I'm not done yet. I'm done with this one, but I'm not completely done yet. Okay, so two last things to say before I end off today. One, uh, today is day 400. I didn't actually realize that, but uh, yeah, that means that... It is, has, indeed, it is, has, it has, indeed, been uh, 400 days since I started recording these all the way back in December of uh, 2014. But, it's not like that really matters. I mean, there's like, like half of those are up, so I mean, that's, that's pretty good. And I have found some of the footage from, uh, well, basically days 100 to 200, so you should be seeing that sometime soon. But uh, also, I realized that I think that that video, the day 390 video, is the longest video I've ever made. Like, the longest single video, at least anyway, because I know a whole bunch of the series is, have been longer. And I mean, obviously, the vlog as a whole is longer than one of its parts. And, you know, the Let's Plays back in the day, obviously, were, were longer. But I don't think I've ever made another video that's anywhere in the 50-minute range. So I think that that is actually the longest video I've ever made. Which is um, impressive, I guess, because that's, that's feature length. That was a feature length vlog. Um, I mean, I was fairly happy with the way it came out. I'm, no, I could have cut out more, but I kind of wanted to let most of it just be there. And, uh, you know, maybe we'll do something weird like that again sometime, but hopefully not something that's going to require seven to eight hours of editing to do it again, because that, uh, that was the annoying part about it. So it took me seven to eight hours to, to actually turn it around and and to put it up and make it watchable and it was literally like a four gigabyte file and I was done with it and usually these are usually in the the three to five hundred megabyte range so yeah that that kind of shows how much it is and I and I don't think I've ever had a vlog before that was over 20 minutes let alone a half an hour or even close to an hour so uh, record shattering day in more than one way with the snow outside and everything but uh anyway I think that is actually going to do it for today because uh, I mean, yeah, really, the only thing that's happened today other than me shoveling the snow was editing, because I was sitting here for many, many hours editing, and I got two more vlogs done after that. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to gonna cut this off here. Tomorrow's Monday. Okay, I guess I'll talk a little bit more about tomorrow. But, because things are still, things are still screwed up. Um, especially in the terms of SEPTA, because I know SEPTA has some systems running. Uh, right now, I think the only one of the regional rails that's running is the R1 to and from the airport. And I think SEPTA is expecting a whole bunch of its lines to be up and running again tomorrow, with the exception of a few of them, including the Trenton line, of course. So the poor R7 Trenton is not going to be running tomorrow, maybe. 
Uh, they haven't said for certain. They just said wait for another update, which is, you know, a bad sign. Which is contradictory to what I would have thought because I would have thought because Amtrak has been running their trains, which run on the same lines all up and down all weekend. They never stopped, so uh, I don't exactly know what's holding up the Trenton line, but. The other three lines that were stopped are on similar tracks coming out of 30th Street. So maybe that has something to do with it, and I'm not 100% certain, but we'll see about that tomorrow. Luckily, though, tomorrow is indeed Monday, which means I don't have class tomorrow. I never have class tomorrow. Drexel is technically open, but I don't have class tomorrow regardless. My sister has off tomorrow as well. And the city of, or Ben Salem Township is closed. The city of Philadelphia is closed public school-wise. So there's still a lot of things that are closed. I mean, there's a lot of snow out there. Let's be real. Even though people are are still trying to to do their go back to their regular lives, it's it's a bit of a problem. But uh, that's tomorrow's problem now, because uh, I'm ending this off here. So thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow for something Monday related.